the Chef Nicola's Buona Forchetta. We are Italian uh, Pizzeria and Trattoria. Trattoria means traditional Italian cuisine. Lay on a basics, on a flavors and simplicities, not on complications, innovation of, of something that you don't need it. So based on great olive oil, nice bread, Italian ciabatta, great wine. Eh? You don't have to miss the wine. If you miss the wine, you don't, you don't communicate Ray. Right. You're not into the zone. So great tomatoes, herbs. You take the herbs, you smell it, it's amazing. So you need to have fresh herbs in the kitchen. You need to have olive oil in the kitchen to be able to put the component, the piece of the puzzles together so that you can move forward, you can create something. The kitchen is not a recipe. It's the concept of knowing the ingredients that you play with and you find out what you do with. So the recipe is just recording tape. It doesn't, it's for pharmacies, it's not for a kitchen. So you need to have smell, nose, you need to use the hands, you need, you need to try the things, and you find the flavor. Add a little bit of pepper, a little bit of salt, olive oil, a little bit of herbs, and you move forward. Now, today we have to do something simple that we do at Momentos every time. It's Italian traditional cuisine. It's nothing, you know, innovative but it's a sample and the best food in the world is not that you invent something silently or innovation or has to be extremely decorative the best thing in the, in the world is when you take a piece of bread and you have a great sauce great meatball and when you eat that it satisfies your palate that simplicity, that is a flavor, that is the best, that is innovation, that is everything that you're looking for. Today what we're gonna do is, in a copper pan, we're introducing you porcini. Porcini mushrooms. I will tell you about. Porcini mushrooms is a northern Italian great definition of oli. The original porcini come from Italy. They grow in every, in every geographically, they go everywhere. They come from South Africa, they come from Seattle, Washington, they come from Italy, now even China does them. So they come everywhere. But the great porcini come from Italy. Now, the porcini, when you do a soup, you cut them before and you let them bleed a little bit. So you have that bleeding, which is the juice. The juice evaporate and take away the acidities and the balance himself when the porcini will saute. There are many ways to do the porcini soups. Many ways. It doesn't exist one way. If your palate, if your hands, if your ingredient, it will match it perfect, and then, and then that's what what's you like it. That's that's that you done it. That's great. I would suggest when you do the porcini, always use the shallots. Shallots. It's cross between the garlic and the onions. It's another ingredient that I would like to use it on this. Copper pen. Copper pen doesn't have an impact of the searing the pen like the aluminum. It's called the, the complete direct hit underneath and will kill the ingredient. Copper pen react a little bit better on certain items, not in everything. And with porcini, you start with a little butter. You put a shallots. The 
the shallots you cut them julienne, you cut them chop, you cut them whatever you want, you put them over here. Let the shallots saute. In a few minutes, the shallots, I will call them, it will settle or will braise lightly on, on a pan. In the meantime, if we take one of these bread, we cut them right here. A little bit of olive oil on this, a little bit of olive oil on that little bit olive oil in my hand and you, you drink it that's the best thing without olive oil you don't go nowhere it clears your voice it clears your nose it clears your body it clears this it does everything that you need it it saves your life coming up next chef nicola finishes off his porcini soup buena forqueta is brought to you by the foley law firm GAC Construction, and Grace Park Senior Living. Ready to get cooking? Why not do it in a brand new kitchen? GAC Construction can remodel your existing kitchen and turn it into something functional and beautiful. Or how about a new bathroom, basement, or deck? GAC Construction does whole house renovations, including siding and window replacement. 40 years in business, same town, same number, over 10,000 satisfied customers. All materials and workmanship are guaranteed, and we are licensed in Pennsylvania and New Jersey. GAC Construction, superior work you can afford. Motor vehicle collisions are leading cause of death and primary cause of catastrophic injuries. Whether you were a victim of a trucking, car, or motor vehicle collision, the Foley Law Firm can help. Our experienced and dedicated lawyers work hard to help victims receive the compensation they need and deserve. We have a medical doctor and a registered nurse on staff to help assist with personal injury cases. Consultations are free and we earn our legal fees only when you win. The Foley Law Firm. We care. We fight. We win. Hi, I'm Sue Chef. I play a chef on TV, slicing, peeling, and sautéing. And when I have a problem with my fixtures, I call the experts at RJ Groner. Call today and get your fixtures fixed the right way. RJ Groner technicians are trained specialists who know how to take care of your home's plumbing, heating, and air conditioning. Customer service is our number one priority. Whether it's an installation or emergency repair, call us at 570-421-7260. This olive oil, we put two bread, two nice ciabatta bread. Little bit salt, little bit pepper, if you want to put a little bit herbs, and you put them right in to toast them. On this, now we put some herbs. Fresh herbs that we chopped it, that is amazing, yeah, this, this. Amazing, these herbs. You put them all there. You take this porcini, you put them in. You see, what is beautiful with the kitchen it is that you gotta feel it. You gotta have that vibe that give you the reason why you're doing it something that sometime you just see the things and you just put them together. You, you, don't, you don't need a pre-reading stuff or these. Or, you just see the things and you come up together to you. The ingredient, the quality is very important, people. Very important. On that, I will add a little bit more olive oil. Never enough olive oil. Always olive oil. Now, on the other hand, here I have a nice broth. This broth is called beef consomme. What is consomme and what is a broth? 
there are two different concepts. Consomme is a lot more concentrated and clearness on a flavor. A broth, it's more put together the flavors and let them the thickness of whatever ingredients you can do, from a chicken to the veal to the beef. You do not specifically clarify the flavor, but you have it as a flavor of the meat, no matter it is. But if you want to specific, specifically clarify it, and you want to make it more specifically the flavor of the items that you put in, you make it definition consommé on a two or two, two or, or, three, or a three processing cooking and clarification on things. This is a consommé that I use because the porcini need a consommé, not just the broth, not just the water. To react is a sensitive on, doesn't matter what type of consommé is, depends on you, what you try. But if you choose to do a consommé of, uh, of, um, of a beef or a fettuccine, a bikini, raviolini, whatever you want to do, you make it consommé. There are three different procedures that you have to do that. Good. Now, don't forget salt and pepper. All that. And you try it. If you don't try, if you don't have a habit as a chef to try the things, what's the purpose of being in the kitchen? Awesome. Now we have this paste. It's made with a porcini. The paste, it is porcini black truffle mushroom paste that you add an in and incorporate into the soup. It is amazing. It is amazing. We we'll let this cook. Now, over here we have nice, great cast iron pan. When you have a cast iron pan, you put a touch of oil on your rag. It's called the devaporation of the pan on reaction on the cooking is going to be balanced better. Why? Cast iron pan can get, when you put, before you put ingredient in cast iron pan, you don't just put on it and let them hit. You will, cast iron pan, you will choose one spot where the heat is going to be and you will concentrate on that spot and hitting around that and you're going to see a difference on the releasing cast iron flavor on your food. But if you're smart and you experiment with the things and you do the things, what you do when you put them in, you balance the oil, balance and speed the heat on a pan, on a cast iron. So before you even start to heat it up nice, with the oil, go around. Now you're going to have impact on the heat on the same direction cooking and as you see it doesn't flame it doesn't release um, any smokes or anything up next chef Nicola works with red snapper enjoy the show I will I love the first movie Grace Park senior living warm comfortable elegant choose your lifestyle cottage independent supportive or memory care and take advantage now of our winter special. Apartments starting at just $2,700. Availability is limited, so contact us today. There's no place like home. 
Visit Grace Park today and find seniors living well. Motor vehicle collisions are leading cause of death and primary cause of catastrophic injuries. Whether you were a victim of a trucking, car, or motor vehicle collision, the Foley Law Firm can help. Our experienced and dedicated lawyers work hard to help victims receive the compensation they need and deserve. We have a medical doctor and a registered nurse on staff to help assist with personal injury cases. Consultations are free and we earn our legal fees only when you win. The Foley Law Firm. We care. We fight. We win. Ready to get cooking? Why not do it in a brand new kitchen? GAC Construction can remodel your existing kitchen and turn it into something functional and beautiful. Or how about a new bathroom, basement, or deck? GAC Construction does whole house renovations, including siding and window replacement. 40 years in business, same town, same number, over 10,000 satisfied customers. All materials and workmanship are guaranteed, and we are licensed in Pennsylvania and New Jersey. GAC Construction, superior work you can afford. We have a beautiful red snapper. Sample fish. You can get sample on that. We have a nice radicchio. Belgium radicchio. Again, don't get complicated. You get complicated, you finish complicated. Beautiful heirloom tomato. Nice Brussels sprout. And nice fingerling potato. The chef can do so much, no matter what you do as a chef. You are 50% or maybe less of what you are in action. You know what is? Without good quality and good product, no matter what you can do, you don't reinvent it. It is a good quality, it will make the customer happy, it will make your life easier, and all surround, you will make it workable, perfect. The quality, it's the number one base that you serve. You can be pretty, you can be whatever you want, you can talk beautifully, you don't have quality, you don't go nowhere, my friend. You're taking a fish. Slightly. I like the whole fish. Why I like the whole fish? I like the whole fish for a simple purpose. The bones have 50% of the flavor. The bones keep the veins together. The bones control the steaming of the cooking and, and the softness of the meat. Release a perfect steaming that doesn't dry. It's a big mistake to take it out of the bones if it's this big. You can defilet it, you can give it the people the same, you can cut them and make it incredible difference. People, try the fish like this. Don't get used only, oh, it's easy to eat it that way. You're killing the flavor, it's easy to eat it that way. You make worthy your money what you eat when you have the fish great. Oh, the whole thing. Salt, herbs, nice peppers, fresh ground peppers, easy as that. In the same pan, I'm gonna do the whole thing. I would suggest, strongly suggestions, do not cook on a cast iron pan with olive oil. Do not. That is not smart. Use blended oil. Blended oil 
it's called blended oil because it will not have the morchia. Morchia is one of the number one strongest acidity that will kill the food if you're using it. That's why the extra virgin olive oil you're using it raw. For ego, you can cook with olive oil because some stupid will believe it. But for technique, do not use it. This is a great tip, chefs. You use it olive oil only if it's gonna stay in a pan. It will not be removed for certain items from some starches, but not for meat and fish. The blended oil doesn't give to the product or doesn't ruin or mix the flavor to the product. But what it does, it just leave the product react by himself the way it is. Instead, olive oil will mess, the, will absolutely mess up the message, the signal between the flavor of the product and what react, and will kill that. Will over dominate one flavor above the other, and you will not, you will not feel one flavor to the other. We leave the pan. The way it is, I shut it off. The fish is very slow, very, very um, uh, small, and it takes very easy to be cooked. We put them in the oven. Simple as that. Still ahead, Chef Nicola explains why homemade pasta needs to be well done. Buena Forqueta is brought to you by the Foley Law Firm, GAC Construction, and Grace Park Senior Living. Enjoy the show. I will. I love the first movie. Grace Park Senior Living. Warm, comfortable, elegant. Choose your lifestyle. Cottage, independent, supportive, or memory care. And take advantage now of our winter special. Apartments starting at just $2,700. Availability is limited, so contact us today. There's no place like home. Visit Grace Park today and find seniors living well. Hi, I'm Sue Chef. I play a chef on TV, slicing, peeling, and sauteing. And when I have a problem with my fixtures, I call the experts at RJ Groner. Call today and get your fixtures fixed the right way. RJ Groner technicians are trained specialists who know how to take care of your home's plumbing, heating, and air conditioning. Customer service is our number one priority. Whether it's an installation or emergency repair, call us at 570-421-7260. If you've never been to Chestnut Hill Nursery during the Christmas season, you really have to stop by. We have fresh cut Christmas trees from local growers, custom handmade wreaths, fresh garland, and gorgeous cemetery items, specially made to honor your loved one. Bring the whole family down to pick out a tree. We have all your favorite varieties. We're open for the Christmas season to December 24th. So stop in. We're located on Route 209 in Broadheadsville or on the web at chnursery.com. We have the porcini soup. You know, when you reach, when you reach in a kitchen, when you reach the concept of playing with the simplicity, naturally will become a habit on you and you will never you will never betray that habit it will follow you that habit and then when you reach that you always can reach and establish another look which I mean a satisfactory for the eye but that is not necessarily unless you establish the habit of a great concept of the great food and then you have the satisfaction of the eye that you put inside as a food. You choose the plate, you choose anything that you think that might make you happy. This homemade pasta over here, which is amazing, is very light. You put them into the... Now, I will explain you something about great pasta. The first pasta. 
first pasta is a starch that made with the fresh eggs. People, chefs, humans, kitchen workers, the pasta, uh, the fresh pasta, homemade pasta need to be well done. Well done. The dry pasta need to be al dente. Two different concepts, two different chewiness, two different flavors, reactions. The starch react differently. This type of pasta need to be well done to react perfect on the flavor. Do not do the homemade pasta al dente. It's a big mistake. It will ruin everything else to you. Open your eyes and perfect that on the best way you can. Be patient and cook it correctly. And the good thing about the fresh pasta, it takes five minutes to be well done. It's so light. Rather than dry pasta from nine minutes to 15 minutes. We have the fish. We're taking it out. I'm a little rough with the oven, so don't mind me. I love fresh fish. I really do, it's one of the products that fresh fish, you gotta have it. A great fish with just a little bit, raw, olive oil. Now we have the pasta. Also on this pasta, don't forget raw olive oil. You see, in the kitchen is um, it's um, um, the kitchen is like a symphony. You gotta be from mise en place to you know a line to the components, the puzzles, put in a such a way that as you're doing the things, by the end of the day, you should have a fun in the kitchen. You shouldn't get, uh, uh, you shouldn't get um, uh, frustrated or, or, or you get mad at it because you're creating something. It should be a fun in the kitchen. So you have the time to drink that wine and to tell, um, to your friends, to whoever is, hey, cheers. At the same time, you accomplish something great. Enjoy. Thank you from Chef Nicola. Mm -hmm.